Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to teach you guys how to make this cylindrical text effect in Adobe Illustrator. This is a really cool one and it's actually pretty easy. So let's jump into it. This effect, it's actually pretty easy. Just grab the type tool and write your text. Go to type, create outlines, grab the direct selection tool. We're gonna select the top of our letter and stretch it out. We need really long letters for this. Do the same thing with the E. And with the Y. All right, select all, command G to group it all together. Open up your symbols panel. You can find it over here. If you can't find it right here, just go to window and look for symbols over here. Drag your text in there and press okay to create a new symbol. You can now delete this one. Make a rectangle. Go to Effect, 3D, Revolve, and this will make a cylinder for you. You can choose the view you prefer. Click on Map Art. Check the invisible geometry box so you can see what's actually happening. And over here you can see the view of your 3D object, so we want to find the, find the sideways view, which is this one. It'll also be highlighted on your artboard. When you found the right side, the right face of your shape, here, select your symbol and place it wherever you want. You can rotate it as well. You can resize it, warp it. When you're happy with it, press OK and OK again. You'll now have your shape. You can expand it. Then go to a clipping mask, release, and then ungroup, ungroup again. And group again. When it's not highlighted anymore, means you've ungrouped it enough times. You can grab uh, your direct selection tool, select these lines that we don't need, and just delete them. When you're done, you can fill it in with a gradient or with whatever color you prefer. Select your letter. You want to duplicate it, or you can just Command C to copy and then Command V to paste it. Right click, transform, reflect, horizontal, press OK, and there you have it. You can align it properly, and in the letter for the letter in the back, you can just lower the opacity. And there you go. Give this video a like, comment, and subscribe if you like this type of content. Make sure to give me a follow on Instagram and on TikTok where I post shorter versions of these tutorials you see over here. And take a look at my new shop, margaritavox.com. I'll put, it, put everything in the description down below. I love you guys and I'll see you soon.